Show two. What up? It's your guest, Tana, aka Tana, baby. It's your boy, Dro, in this goddamn thing. What's up, y'all? We got reaction videos for y'all today. You did me. We gonna react to FBG Duck. R.I.P. You dig me? Dead up, bitches. He dropped this video three weeks ago, and a lot of people say that him recently getting shot was his karma for this. For dropping this for video. For this right song here. and this video. So we gonna check it out because I like that one FBG Duck song that if he can slide for the nigga bitch. Hey, that's my jam right there, oh, boy. Yeah, oh, <laughs> it's, it's a real nigga party. You cannot get in. Hey. Hold him off his hands. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Damn, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Listen to Duck before, you know? So, we gonna see. We've reacted to Duck quite a few times on this channel. So, let's see. I, I haven't listened to Dead Bitches, so we gonna see what what was going on with this right here. So, yeah. And my man's already at uh, 3.4 million. Yeah. Three and a half million, so. so. Let's see what he's talking about on this channel. Right you should know he wrote. He a fucking white boy. <laughs> Zone. Hey, my bad. But I used to love playing tens, bro. I need to give me some tens. I got That's some. Right. I miss mine. Yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah, I <laughs> if we ever said it, fuck that bitch. I swear to God, we mean. We already in hell, bitch. Since twelve, we been things. Ever since I signed the deal, all these bitches on my penis. Boy, you ain't gon' squeeze it, you around for no reason Boy, what block you from? Let us know so we can spin it <laughs> Made Chicago legend He said, what block you from? Let, Let us know. know so we can spin that know bitch me? Yeah, that was just about business no. Said I won't go this to dead And okay, I did it But nigga, fuck T-Roy and O.D. them dead Boy, that extendo live, y'all. I'm about to get that one he got. Hit, I think that's the man. one they found when he got oh, killed. Real? Yeah, it jammed. Like Damn. they said, he was trying to shoot that, but it jammed. One thing about when you get, I'm about to get me ex one, this and they, one, one thing about when you try to get when you get an extendo clip, make sure it's not like a, a, a make sure it's like the manufacturer of your not, gun's not extendo clip. Yeah, yeah, not an aftermarket extendo clip because that shit will make your gun jam. You got Smith and Weston, get Smith and Weston. Yeah, clip, for sure. Bro. Y'all heard about Jake Money? Yeah, yeah. Niggas getting dead the same way. Bitch, don't play with gang. You don't want look, bro, in your gang way. I know you heard about look, bro. Yeah. They never shit by twice. Bullets was hitting him. He was singing like Mariah. Yeah, you heard about Shabra. Uh, uh. mm, so I guess he named it Ops. That ain't got pop. Sound like got to pop, me. Bro. That's, okay, so I see why they said this might have been the reason he got spun on. Uh, I heard the hog. Uh, he probably walking, listening to us. Uh, yeah, you heard about listing. Uh, yeah, I heard about that too. But fuck him though, he a pack too big. What if we ever said it? Fuck that bitch, I swear to God. We okay, he was real disrespectful. Yeah, he going, he going in on nigga. He was now. real disrespectful. Uh, we already in hell, bitch, since 12, we been things. Ever since I signed the deal, all these bitches on my penis. Boy, you ain't gon' squeeze it, you around for no reason. Boy, what block you from? Let us know so we can spin it. Made Chicago legend. Shit, that was just about business. Said I won't go this to dead, and okay, I did it. But nigga, fuck T-Roy and O.D. them dead, bitch. Not for real, fuck them niggas. All my ops, bitch. Heard he mixing brick name. Uh-uh, no, he didn't. My bro was selling box blow. He was somewhere swimming. When Brody got his ass kicked, they ain't stand no business. I go to deep thing, gravy take a piss of this shit. Damn. I know deep deep thing is dirt them people for sure. Damn, Dirk. Dirk, Dirk always talk about deep thing. And I think that's kind of like a, I know him and Dirk don't get along. Him and Vaughn always dissing each other. It's crazy. Yeah. Like, Damn, I make that bro. bitch up my team. If I got to pull a miss, I swear to God, I will fail. But I can't let them see my face because they might tell. But if we ever said it's up, that bitch, I swear to God, we mean it. We already in hell, bitch, since 12, we been things. Ever since I signed the deal, all these bitches on my penis. Boy, you ain't gonna squeeze it, you around for no reason. Boy, what block you from? Let us know so we can spin it. Made Chicago legend shit. That was just about business. <laughs> Said I won't go this to dead. And okay, I did it. But nigga, fuck T Roy and OD them dead bitches. Hey. Alright, y'all. Hey. 
y'all, that was FBG Duck with Dead Bitches. I don't think we should give this any rating. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because I just don't think we should rate it. But I will say that I could see what they was talking they about. Like, like, this, this might have been, like, you know what I'm saying? Because he was dissing. Like, like he said, they said he wasn't going to diss the dead. He said, fuck it, he did. Yeah, you know that's. Saying? I, I mean, more, several times. What I will the video. say is this, though. You dig me? You have to be careful when people always talking about they on demon time. Well, when you turn your back to your angels and you follow the demons, your angels no longer guide you and watch, watch over watch you. Because he's been shot before, but I don't think he's ever been like, oh, I'm on that demon time. So when you have to be careful what you speak out into the universe because your guardian angels hit it and they don't want to see that part of you. So they no longer watch over you when you talk about you on that demon time. So you got to be careful with that stuff. You and it's, 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 forces, it's forces here that, you know what I'm saying, that we know nothing about. Yeah. When you talk, when you talk, when you speak on the dead, you know what I'm saying, when you speak on people that passed away. Yeah. You know what I'm saying, bro? They... You, you can't do that because it's certain things that just might might come back and bite you in the ass. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? I think you should never speak on anyone who can't who can't speak for themselves. themselves. Really? So that goes the same for Duck. I don't. I think uh, Six Hundred Breezy today dropped the disc, or he might have dropped it yesterday. But they got killed, and I think you know he shouldn't. He, I know he's like, oh, I'm an artist. I dropped the song because I've been wrote, did the song. But it's like I think you should be very careful and have. At yeah, least, Apple, yeah, right. it's like just let that shit go. He, yeah. He's dead and gone. There's no more beef at that point. And I think that Chicago is about to be in for a rude awakening. Oh man, I think this will start off a war again. She about to get spawned. Yeah, for real. I think it's about to be a war again. Like when Chief Keith and them first dropped, and they um, little JoJo got killed, and then they was just picking off bodies. You know what I'm saying? So I pray for Chicago for real, man, and. Pray for FVG Duck and his family because his brother was killed like a couple years ago. So mm -hmm. now his mom, his parents got to bury another kid. And another one of their children. Yeah, another man, one of their kids. Any, you, as a parent, you don't ever, you don't ever want to outlive your children. Yeah. It's not supposed to go that way. You know what I'm saying? But in the same, in the same sense, you know that is that's Chirac. Yeah. You know what I mean? And it. They might have a different state of mind, but like I'm saying, you, you a parent don't ever want to go. Well, crazy it. thing is that these streets that are beefing, sixty thirty, they literally sixty four, they literally a block the block over. You guys are neighbors and y'all beefing like crazy like that. Like can nigga just hop the back fence? And yeah, just exactly. Fucking... And then a lot of them be like cousins. I forgot who and who was cousins and they was beefing Dirk and somebody. Really? And it's like they was beefing. They like cousins. Yeah. And it's like, damn, you shoot me your family. Wow. Yeah, they be like blood cousins and shit. And I forget, I think I watched the Herbo That's thing, no and he go. was like, somebody he was beefing with bad. They was like, grew up together, like they moms was best friends. And it's like, wow. as they got older and they moved separate to separate streets, now they gang is beefing, and it's like, damn, that's crazy. So it's, I, it's crazy. I, I get it. You 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 do you do come a part of who your company is. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So you can't be on 63rd and. You come from 64th and be and just be out there 64th when you surrounded by a bunch of niggas on 63rd yeah. and vice versa. You can't be from, you know what I'm saying? You can't be from 63rd and go to 64th from yell 63rd when you surrounded by a bunch of niggas from 64th. Yeah. So I get it, you know what I'm saying? Why you got to make the switch, but you can always you can always put a limit, you know what I'm saying, to your beefing. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You can always do it, especially if, if you fan. You know yeah. what I mean? For sure, Especially your it's crazy that it comes, to, it gets to that point. So I really do pray Chicago finds at least Man. a comic. They they have no more. I watched the thing earlier today where they talk about how their gang leaders were all taken down. They were either put in jail or killed. So the kids that are now running Was that the when street, the guards came in, huh? When the guards came in, because they had recently just sent the guards over to. No, no, no! Like a long time ago. Oh, okay, okay. Like okay. Uh, that, a lot of their gang leaders, the GDs and BDs, their leaders have either been killed or arrested and are in jail for a long time. And so the kids now that are running the streets that are GDs and BDs, they have no structure anymore because gangs were about a lot of structure. Like it used to be, like a long time ago. California two gangs used to be nobody is no hits or orchestrated unless somebody really put that there's no unless like, your OG yeah tell unless you. your OG said there's no spinning the block none of that 
-hmm. Nowadays, it's like it's a free for all, and this shit crazy, man. And I'm tell you, I'm gonna tell y'all one thing, man. You know what I'm saying? You you always think it's like the older cats has been in the game, where they they've been in the game for a reason for so long because they were able to. You know what I'm saying? It's not just because they got lucky. It's because they they had their wits about them. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And it's really, you know what I'm saying, when you're a youngster in the game, the youngsters are the ones that got something to prove. Mm -hmm. They got something to prove, so they gonna, they gonna set it off and spin the block regardless, yeah. you know what I'm saying? So they need that structure. And man. that's where that, that structure man, failed at. That's but, sad, bro. Yeah, it's crazy. Because games, they used to be not about like the territory. It used to be about just protecting your neighborhood from crooked ass cops and shit like Yo, that. That's where, gang, real that's where gangs yeah. came from and then I, they put the drugs and shit into the neighborhoods and then they got the beefing over that and money in the turf and shit. Yeah, yeah but she it. it got crazy. But, make sure you guys go check out this F.E.G. Duck video. I'll put the link down in the description. R.P. Duck, you know what I'm saying? I pray Man, for your family, so. pray for your mom because she got to bury another son, her second son, she got she has to bury him. My prayers go out to you, mama, for real. For sure. You know what I'm saying? All his friends, fans, all that. Everybody. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, yeah, I mean, y'all gotta do, you gotta do a little better, man. Get, I know it, it, it ain't gonna happen overnight, but it's gonna take a lot of progress. It is. It is. And I know it's hard, especially when you got, when you got, when you got, you know, when you got a body that's gone, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? And that's your, that's your homie, I, I, that's I your think, family. It's, yeah, it's hard it's like you. You can't, everybody it's hard want, it's a retaliation thing. Everybody, you know somebody's gonna want to retaliate and they gonna retaliate and kill somebody and then they side don't feel like it's gonna yep. retaliate and then that's the cycle because everybody gonna feel like they gotta get a get back i want our nose they beefing and all that but i want to give a shout out to g herbo you know what i'm saying because he has started a thing for chicago which is where he's from he started a thing called swerving uh for a uh, mental thing and trauma uh -huh. in chicago so uh -huh. Up, he started a thing to help up, Chicago youth deal with their trauma that they see every day of people getting killed, kids getting killed, kids That's as important. young as five years old. So he's he starting up. something to help them get therapy and stuff that they need for their mental state in Chicago. So shout out to that boy G Herbo for that because definitely need it. Man, nah, straight up, nah. I mean, just y'all you know saying y'all. I know uh, it's probably like Tanner said at the beginning of the video. It's probably gonna be some retaliation, you know what I'm saying, for Doug getting hit. But I mean, y'all do the best y'all can, you know what I'm saying? Just, just kind of in that man and shit. For sure. So R.I.P. Y'all be safe out there in Chirac and everywhere else in the world, you know yes, what I'm sir. saying? Lebanon, whatever happened over there, that big explosion, bombing, whatever. Y'all be safe everywhere in the world. Stay prayed up, you know what I'm saying? And uh, yeah, man, you already know how that thing go over here on Rich Society TV. We Gotta ain't go. the gang, nope. we ain't the squad, nah. we that mob, yeah.